Have you ever thought of a world where machines can understand and respond to the visual information just like us humans? Where you show an AI an image and it can tell you the story behind it? That reality is closer than you think. From the creators of GPT-3, the AI that blew our minds with its understanding of language comes GPT-4, stepping into the realm of images. Imagine an AI model that not only processes text but can make sense of the images too. Sounds fascinating, doesn't it? But how does this work? What could this mean for us? And why are tech giants like Microsoft and Google so interested? Today, we're diving deep into these questions. We're going to talk about GPT-4's capabilities, its applications, and the buzz it's creating in the tech world. We'll also be sharing insights from top tech leaders like Microsoft Germany's CTO, Andreas Braun, and CEO, Marianne Janik. And we'll discuss why Elon Musk, the co-founder of OpenAI, has mixed feelings about the direction his former company is taking. So buckle up, because this is going to be a thrilling ride through the landscape of cutting-edge AI technology. Stay tuned, because what you're about to witness might just reshape your understanding of AI. You won't want to miss a second of it. Remember, curiosity drives innovation. Let's explore together. So let's begin with showcasing the improvements of GPT-4 standardized tests. GPT-4 scored in the 90th percentile or above in multiple simulated exams, such as the Uniform Bar Exam, LSAT, SAT Evidence-Based Reading and Writing, SAT Math, GRE Verbal, and several AP exams. The performance on CodeForce's rating, however, remains low. Machine Learning Benchmarks GPT-4 is also outperforming its predecessor in traditional machine learning benchmarks. For example, it scores 86.4% in MMLU multiple-choice questions in 57 subjects, compared to GPT-3.5 70.0%. Similarly, in AI2 Reasoning Challenge, it scores 96.3% compared to gpt 3.5s 85.2%. Other languages. Interestingly, GPT 4's English language performance is surpassed in the MMLU benchmark when translated into a variety of languages, showing strong capabilities even in low resource languages like Latvian, Welsh, and Swahili. Internal use. GPT 4 is also proving useful in internal operations such as support, sales, content moderation, and programming. Visual inputs. A significant development in GPT-4 is its ability to accept a prompt of text and images, allowing users to specify any vision or language task. While still in research preview, this could pave the way for more versatile applications of the model. Here's the breakthrough. GPT-4 isn't confined to text inputs. It accepts images as prompts, too. It's designed to generate text outputs given inputs consisting of interspersed text and images. Whether it's documents with text and photographs, diagrams, or screenshots, GPT-4 exhibits similar capabilities as it does with text-only inputs. Now imagine the possibilities. GPT-4 describing the content of an image to you, identifying objects, their colors, their relationships. It could answer queries about an image or even suggest text content based on image prompts. But that's not all. OpenAI announced at their summit on March 14, 2023, that GPT-4 will have the capability of inputting images, offering us completely different possibilities. GPT-4 will offer completely different possibilities, for example, videos. However, while we were expecting more multimodal elements like video within GPT-4, today's announcement reveals the only multimodal element is the inputting of images. Now, you might wonder how this is different from other AI language models. Well, Microsoft has presented its multimodal language model, Cosmos One, which can interpret images along with text. For instance, a picture of a clock showing 1010 can be inputted into Cosmos One with the question, the time now. The AI replies, 1010 on a large clock. Cosmos One can even identify a woman's hairstyle or a movie poster and tell the user when that movie will be released. During a recent AI in Focus, digital kickoff event in Germany, Microsoft Germany's CEO, Marianne Janik, provided an interesting perspective on GPT models. Chat GPT is an iPhone moment. It's not about replacing jobs, but about doing repetitive tasks differently than before. Disruption does not necessarily mean job losses. It will take many experts to make the use of AI value-adding. 
Janik emphasizes that AI like GPT is about optimizing the way we perform tasks, not necessarily replacing human jobs. This highlights the important role AI will continue to play in our lives. But it's not just OpenAI and Microsoft in the AI race. Google is also keenly interested, working on its own image processing technology, Imogen. All these tech giants are striving to improve accuracy, creativity, and user accessibility. Imagine two of the world's tech titans, Google and Microsoft, embroiled in a fierce and thrilling contest of innovation. The ultimate prize? Harnessing the immense potential of GPT-4's image processing capabilities and incorporating them into their own technologies. It's an exhilarating race against time, with each company pouring in resources, expertise, and creative thought to maximize accuracy, enhance creative output, and streamline user accessibility of their image processing technologies. These tech giants are in a relentless pursuit of excellence, constantly pushing the boundaries of what's achievable with artificial intelligence. Their quest isn't just about standing out in the crowd, it's about transforming the way we interact with digital media and expanding the horizons of our digital experiences. Now, consider the story of ChatGPT. This AI language model has shattered records, rapidly becoming the fastest-growing consumer app ever to amass a staggering 100 million users. From trending hashtags on Twitter to rave reviews on tech blogs, the buzz around ChatGPT is inescapable. Its ability to generate human-like text has resonated with a vast and diverse user base, fundamentally altering the landscape of AI applications. With GPT-4 now capable of processing images in addition to text, we stand on the precipice of a new wave of AI adoption. Just imagine the potential applications and the seismic shift it could bring about in various industries. And so our journey continues, fueled by relentless innovation, shaped by our collective vision for the future. As we dive deeper into the world of AI, let's remember that this journey is as much about the voyage as it is about the destination. But every silver lining has a cloud, right? OpenAI, the company behind GPT, faced criticism from its co-founder, Elon Musk. Musk, who left the company in 2018, has expressed his concerns. OpenAI was created as an open-source, non-profit company to serve as a counterweight to Google, but now it has become a closed-source, maximum-profit company effectively controlled by Microsoft, Musk wrote on February 17th. Not what I intended at all. Like a captivating novel with its gripping plots and riveting characters, the narrative of artificial intelligence is constantly unfolding, page by page, chapter by chapter. And right now, we stand on the brink of a new era, as GPT-4 takes center stage, promising to transform the way we interact with technology. We've already been captivated by the advent of GPT-4, OpenAI's latest marvel. But it doesn't stop there. On one hand, we have the development of multimodal language models like Microsoft's Cosmos One, pushing the boundaries of AI's capabilities. On the other, we have tech giants like Google, stepping up their game, gearing up to make their own mark in this new landscape. With GPT-4, we're embarking on an unprecedented journey. This technology isn't just describing images, it's decoding them, it's understanding them, and even suggesting content based on them. It's like teaching a machine to see, to interpret the world as we do, merging the realms of human cognition and artificial comprehension. But with every new journey comes new challenges, new crossroads. The world of AI, vast as an ocean, is teeming with possibilities. The potential applications of GPT-4 are as wide and varied as the sea life inhabiting this metaphorical ocean. We hope you enjoyed this deep dive into GPT-4 and the world of AI. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more tech updates. Until next time, stay curious, stay informed, and keep exploring.